Next up in my buttercream series is Ermine. I tested eight buttercreams and this one had the least amount of butter and sugar, yet was one of the most stable. So you'll want to try this one if you like the texture and flavor of heavy whipped cream, but you want the stability of a buttercream. It got a five out of five on piping, takes a little bit of practice to get it smooth on cake, so I gave it a one out of five there. And it withstands pressure very well, so I got a five out of five. The first step in this frosting is to make a flour paste by cooking flour and milk in a pan. Once it's all thickened, I'll go ahead and add in the white sugar. Once it starts bubbling, cook for an additional minute and then pour it into a sheet pan and then cover it with plastic wrap. Once that's cooled, I will whip my softened butter until it's lighter in texture and color. Then take that flour paste and you can kind of see the texture here. Now I'm going to drop it in a little bit at a time and then mix it on high speed for about a minute once it's all added. Then I'll switch to the paddle attachment to smooth out all those air pockets that the whisk introduced and flavor with some vanilla and salt. 